Where are we going? We are rest in peace, mate. Embarrassing, 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 embarrassing. Rest in peace, mate. RIP, mate, United. United, mate, we are falling, mate. We are falling, mate. That club, mate, is gone. I'm lost for words, absolutely lost for words. That was absolutely shocking. Beyond belief. We need to start again. I told you, I told you at Newcastle. Did I tell you at Newcastle, mate? I said to you, reset and start again, mate. Rest in peace, mate. Absolutely rest in peace, mate. Football club, mate, has died. Absolutely died, man. This football club is falling, mate. From top to bottom, yeah? They've fallen. Shocking, mate. No ideas, no tactics. Clueless, clueless football. Bang average players. Woodward's a banker. Don't give a fuck about this football club. Glazers, they don't give a fuck about this football club, yeah? They've hung out a manager to dry. In, out of his debt manager. Hung him out to dry. We are falling, mate. Edward has, has rotten the football club to his core. Out of debt manager. Out of debt players. Players hung out to dry. And I've been telling you, yeah, AC Milan 2.0 we are, mate. And, I've been, and I told you from day one, yeah, they were a top club. They had Ronaldinho, they had all the players in the world, yeah. And what happened, yeah, the financial side of it, they, they took advantage of that, yeah. And what they did was they, 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 they lacked the side of the football pitch. And what happened, they fall and they crumble. May United are an elite club that have fallen, mate. Let's get real out of here. Absolutely shocking, mate. That out there, mate, no need for that. Absolutely no need for that. Man's paying 700 quid, yeah, for that shite, mate. 700 quid, yeah, for Jack Cork, yeah. 700 quid for Jack Cork and what's his name, Westwood, yeah, to boss midfield. 700 fucking quid, mate, I pay for that, yeah. And the Burnley fans are screaming their love like they won an FA Cup final. We are done out here. We are done out here. RIP, Man United, mate. RIP, Man United, mate. We are finished, mate. Only going to soul try yeah? Let me just look at the football side of it, yeah? But I'll get to the owners in a bit, mm. you get me? On the football side, yeah? How, how are you telling me, yeah, you need 4 3 3 from Burnley? Are you out of your mind, Flex, yeah? Are you telling me you need three, three midfielders in there? You play a 4 4 2, yeah? And you go at the game and you win the game in the first half. 4 4 2 today would have killed them off. Because you know why? The two centre backs would have been occupied. Mason Greenwood and Martial would have occupied the centre midfielders. You go direct. You don't play three midfielders at home. I've been crying out for how many seasons. Matic today was not needed. He was, he was almost today a centre back. Getting the ball, receiving like a quarterback. All he did was say pass down there. Say pass down there. No killer pass, no nothing. The football club has to reset, start again, mate. Top four, forget all that nonsense about top four. Start again, reset, get the dead one out, and get everyone out of this football club from the top to the bottom. Glazers, get the fuck out of the football club. If you don't care about the fans here, get the heck out of here. We are paying 700 quid for my fucking season ticket here for fucking what, mate? For fucking what? And Woodward, yeah, sat in his chair, don't give a fuck about the football club. All he cares about is a commercial avenue and the commercial priorities for this football club. Apart from that, yeah, you don't give a shit about this football club. I've come out here, yeah, cold night, foggy night, yeah, for fucking Westwood and Cork to be playing us off the park, mate. Westwood and fucking Cork. The club, yeah, is done, mate. Absolutely done out here. And I've been telling you, I'm telling you, yeah, this football club is finished. The backroom staff are absolutely shite, mate. Mike Freeling, yeah, all he does, yeah, hands in his pockets. You've got Michael Carrick, trusted as a... As a, as, a, as a position in this, in this team, yeah? In this, the manager of Blackwell staff, no experience. Kieran McKenna, no experience, yeah? Mike Freeling, man, should have left for itself. Erickson left. Let's be real out here, yeah? He's one of our own, mate. We are done out here, mate. Man, like fucking J. Rodriguez, mate. His career should have been in the championship by now. A man is there singing his name up. We are done out here, mate. The football club is gone, mate. Died. The football club is died, mate. We are finished, mate. Absolutely rotten to the core, mate. And I'm sat here on the ones, yeah, and I'm just... Burnley Football Club have embarrassed us today. In a 4-4-2 in a 4 4 2 style formation, yeah, that, you know what, hard work and desire. And every single person knew what they're doing. Sean Dyke was absolutely livid out there. Every single time Wood made a mistake, yeah, get in your position. What are you doing there? Every single person knew what they were doing. They were in coordinations. And what did we do? We have the manager sat on his ass, yeah, for almost 75 minutes. I'm sick of this, man. I'm sick of this, man, yeah? This football club has finished, man. Absolutely finished, bro. The early football club, we had no ideas. Yes, Martial should have scored. Yes, all this should happen, mate. But the bottom line is, yeah, we are just not good enough to compete at the highest level. We are where we are. And we are a mid-table club, and that is that. Get the reality checks in, yeah? We are a mid-table club, and that is what we are right now. 
done out here, mate. Absolutely done out here, mate. Yeah. You, you're relying on one transfer match for the match and matter for the whole game. Is this what we become now? That's what Crystal Palace and them two. No disrespect, yeah. This is what Crystal Palace and Burnley do. They came here, they got the two goals, and they got it. That's what they do. Man United don't do that, flex, man. You don't do that. You have what two chances the whole game. It should be constant attack for the whole game. But you know what? It's what well, you know what it is, yeah. It's freestyle football. I told you, mate. Ole Gunnar freestyle. I told you from day one, yeah. There's no pattern of play. There's no uh, constant attack. I've had enough of this football club. I've had enough of Ed Woodward. I've had enough of Glazer. Every single person, yeah. If you're not willing to fight for the cause, yeah. If you're not willing to invest in this football club. Get the fuck out of here. We don't need you, man. Yeah. Piss thing, man. Absolute piss thing, man. We've got a traffic marshal's manager because at the end of the day, all he does, yeah, listen, stay compact. That's what the, all has been done in the training ground. Stay compact, yeah, and use the wingers. That's the only thing I see about Ole Gunnar Solskjaer. It says use his wingers. Everything else, it's non-existent. So that's why, for me, it comes down to the board level. They've got a manager, David Moyes, out of his depth. You know what I mean? Van Gaal, they should have given time too. But you know what? It was boring football and the fans had enough, yeah? Jose Mourinho, they went into success. But what happened? Boring football and negative tactics and he almost got himself sacked. Then they got a manager and thought, you know what? Legend of the football club. Legend of the football club. Everyone's going to be happy. And you know what, mate? They still are. And that's a worrying side for me. You know what I mean? Man out here, kids are like just sitting down here, bro. Look at the kids out here, man. Just sitting here. What have they seen, man? What has this football club given them to hope for? Absolutely nothing, man. Shocking, man. Shocking, shocking, shocking. RIP this football club, mate. Done out here, mate. Edward, get the fuck out of here. Blazers, get the fuck out of here, mate. RIP United, mate. Shit. But you know what, mate? I don't even expect anything, mate. This club, yeah, is finished, mate. Absolutely done out here. Bruno Fernandes, yeah? He's looking at that thinking, what the fuck am I coming there for? <laughs> Top, the, the fifth in the league, yeah? Playing Bora football, unaspiring manager. The clubs don't give a fuck about the football club. You know what I mean? Why would I come to them? That's what they're thinking. That's what's really stalling behind the scenes. Forget all his valuation and all that, yeah? When he looks at that, yeah, and he thinks, you know what? Is it even me worth it coming there? When you've got people like Tottenham around there, you've got people like Inter Milan, there'll be, be other people, company, because today there was reported here, yeah, other clubs are, are trying to get him. Absolutely. And what does that come to? Bruno Fernandes is assessing the option. Because tonight, yeah, we had Anderson, Anders Pereira, yeah, who th thinks he's caca, mate. You're not caca, yeah? Stop thinking you're caca. You know what I mean? You're a Brazilian, B-Tech Brazilian, yeah? Who should not even be nowhere near this squad, yeah? There's so many dead ones in this squad, yeah? I'd get rid of most of them, mate. Absol you know who I'd keep in that squad, yeah? Juan Misaka, yeah? And I think Harry Maguire is a player in there. Tonight, it was awful. Mm. Harry Maguire, yeah? There's a player in there. Martial, Rashford. Do you know what, mate? And Fred. There's five players I keep in that squad, mate. Mm. Just five. And that is, for me, shocking, mate. Everything needs to be done from top to bottom. But you know what, mate? The Woodward and the Glazers will still be here. Because you know why? Because you know why the money that's coming from this football club and the commercial have you and the people that are coming to the mega store, yeah? I don't care, mate. You come into the mega store and you're funding the Glazers, mate. That's what we're doing right now. The bigger picture is these guys won't go. The Saudis, yeah, they said they will only buy this football club under a certain price and the Glazers want five billion. Who in the right mind is going to go buy United for five billion? This football club is the best right now. And that's why I'm not even ranting now. It's got to the point where I'm looking at it and I'm sad. That's the reality we're at right now. We're not, we're not on an 11 playing field where we say, what is the real problem at United? And we need to make an effort now. This is a time to protest, yeah? To walk out the stadium. I'll be real out here, man. You've got to walk out the stadium now. Because if it's not going to happen now, yeah, it will never happen. Because at the end of the day, yeah, we are not winning no trophies this season. Europa League, forget that, mate. FA Cup, mate. Watford, I'm not even confident, mate. Top four could have been absolutely gone for us, mate. Because Chelsea are inconsistent. Arsenal are not that good. Tottenham, inconsistent, but they won tonight. Mm. Top four could have been nailed on for us. But you know what, mate? We've got an out-of-depth manager. Our club doesn't, doesn't care. Players are just not good enough, mate. They're not good enough to be consistent. And right now, Rashford's out. You know what I mean? Martial's limping now, mate. I've seen him limping towards the end, mate. Mm. James, I love the guy, yeah? Just not good enough for this level. And that's no disrespect to the guy, yeah? Just not good for this level. We are in a mess right now. And I keep telling you, mate, RIP United, mate.